Hey guys, Chris here, and today, guys, I have another Battlefield Hardline Gold Gun Guide, this time on the M416. And just before we get into, you know, this Gold Gun Guide, I do have another one going up with, on the Scar H in a few days, so look out for that too at the end of the intro, uh, the outro, because it'll probably be uploaded on the 24th, or probably the 25th or the 26th, so look out for that. So anyway, the M416 was one of the launch weapons a Battlefield Hardline and was one of the three god guns of the game before other amazing guns started coming in with the DLCs, the FAL for example. The M4 is still one of the best guns in Hardline, available only for the criminals until you get a weapon license voucher or do the weapon license glitch. For the setups, uh, I would recommend a Cobra site, but any site would work because, you know, that's your opinion. Uh, extended magazine or laser sight, depending on which one you want. In my opinion, extended magazine is better because it gives you some extra bullets to finish off a few of more enemies. Uh, for muzzles, I would recommend a heavy barrel, compensator, or muzzle brake. You can use a suppressor if you want to stay stealthy, but the three that I recommend are much better and provide more control over your weapon. And finally, for the grips, I'd go with a stubby or angle grip depending on which muzzle you choose. Play around with these setups so you can see which one plays best for you. And there we go, getting the M416 Gold, my third gold gun, and honestly, it looks badass just like the others I got, but this time it, it, look, it looks pretty much better than, you know, the other ones, even though the FAL and the MPX and the Scar H are okay. So pretty much, like I said, with the M416, uh, it, it was one of the god guns of Hardline alongside the AKM and the M16A3 until you know other weapons start taking over but pretty much you uh, the m416 is still good it's honestly it's, it's a great weapon you can kill people in like i would say two to four shots depending on you know how far your enemy is but honestly it's still an amazing weapon and if you haven't tried it for some reason you should go try it so guys that'll be it for this short gold gun guide video i'm really sorry about that i don't have anything else to talk about so if you enjoyed drop a like and subscribe and turn on the bell icon as well Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you later.